E equals M C squared. The formula. Um, Blake, what are you doing? I'm teaching the TV to be smarter. No, I meant use this Google Chromecast. This is why we need more communication, Kevin. <laughs> so dramatic. I don't get it. Okay, so Kevin and I are planning on doing a movie night tonight, but instead of letting me go and buy a brand new smart TV like I want, he's convinced we can upgrade our old one and make it smarter. No, but... it's too expensive to buy a new one. Here, let me just show you how simple this whole process is with three easy steps. Step one, purchase a Google Chromecast. So we have a link in the description below. You can go ahead, check that out if you want to. But once you go ahead and purchase that, we gotta wait for it to come. Once it's delivered, Go and grab it, open it up. You should have three things you'll need to work with. The Chromecast itself, a micro USB, and a power brick. Step two, look for an empty HDMI slot on your TV. If there isn't one, make room for one. Plug in your Chromecast to your preferred HDMI port. Okay, so far so easy. So how do we power it now? Well, remember the micro USB cable that came with it? Grab that and plug it in the bottom of the Chromecast device. Then, take the other end of the USB and plug it into the power brick that came with the Chromecast. Yeah, Kev, this cord isn't very long. What if, what if I can't reach the outlet? Easy! If you can't reach the closest outlet, rip off the power brick and toss it. Instead, if your TV has a USB slot on the back of it, go ahead and plug it in right there. And that will work just as well to power it. Uh, are you doing okay, Blake? Yeah, yep. I'm good. Okay. Kev, what's step three? Step three. So next you'll want to turn on your TV. Use the remote to turn it on and make sure you pick the right source for the HDMI of your Chromecast. Once booted up, your TV should prompt you to download the Google Home app, which we'll have linked in the description below as well. Once downloaded, open the app and create an account if you don't already have one. Under the name of your home, the app should prompt you to set up Chromecast. If you don't see it there, click on the plus symbol on the top left corner of the app. Tap on set up device, New Devices, choose which home you want to add it to, and the app will begin to look for the Chromecast. Here, the app will ask you if you want to set up the device. Say Next. Next, the app will give you a four-digit pin. Match this pin with the one on your TV. If it matches, it's correct, and it's the right device. Then it's going to ask you if you want to share your info with Google. That's completely your choice, so go ahead and pick what you want. Time to pick what room you want your device in. You can pick one from the list here, or go ahead and create a custom one as well. Now it's time to connect to your Wi-Fi, so go ahead and click on your Wi-Fi and enter your password. Here you'll link your Google account to your Chromecast. Tap continue. Here the app will ask you if you want to receive any emails from Google. Once you get to this page, the app just summarizes everything we've just done to set this up. From here, open your Netflix app on your phone, find the movie you want to watch, and click on the cast icon right here to start watching your favorite movie. But before you do that, make sure you check out this playlist right here of other smart home tools that you might want to use with your TV. 